Hello guys, this is Raptamon132 here, and welcome to my 7th blind commentary video post of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic Season 6. Yep, uh, as you all know, I did Episode uh, 6. Today, I'll be looking at Episode 7. And this one is called... Newbie Dash. Huh. Interesting. Uh, well... Judging by the title, I'd say this is probably going to be a Rainbow Dash centered episode. Like, judging by the title. And, newbie, uh. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what to expect. Could be that. You know, could be that she's. Well, I don't know. I really don't know what to expect. So. All I can say that it's probably a Rainbow Dash centered episode. So, yeah, I guess, you know, as usual, the only way to find out is to, is to watch the episode. So, yeah, without further ado, let's begin. Here we go. Ah, Rainbow. Hey, I thought... Rainbow Dash! Huh? Oh, Scootaloo. Hi, Scootaloo. What's up? The Rainbow Dash fan club just decided every pony's coming to see you when the Wonderbolt's new tour comes through Ponyville. Well, it's really? Great that you guys are going to the show, Scoop. Huh. Ah, uh, yes, the she's the head of the one. Preserve the in the show unless one Rainbow of the Dash real Wonderbolts club. can't fly. <laughs> I'll probably be working crowd control or something. You're still Maybe. gonna be wearing a Wonderbolt's uniform, though, right? A reservist one, yeah. Hmm, that's good enough for me. <gasps> huh? What's going on? Hey, Spitfire, Fleetfoot, and Soren. You gotta do superhero landing. Wait for it. Ha! <laughs> Good landing, Spitfire. Woo! Superhero landing. Yeah, you know, that's really hard on your knees. Totally impractical. They all do it. Rainbow Dash, glad we found you. We need you in the show when we get to Ponyville. Flying. Huh? She's only in the reserves. Not anymore, kid. <laughs> what? <gasps> so you're finally a full fledged wonderbolt. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Rainbow Dash. Woo! Wow. She's stunned. She can't <laughs> what believe. What she said. <laughs> well. This is a surprising turn of events. It seems like Rainbow Dash is finally going to be part of the Wonderbolts now. <laughs> Actually, that that explains it. Newbie Dash, because she's the new, because she's a new member. <laughs> well, looks like Rainbow's going to as for, looks like Rainbow is going to fulfill her dream of becoming a Wonderbolt finally. That's great news. Good honor. But yeah. Oh, that's her house. What? Uh, any pony see my wing bomb? I don't want to be stiff when I show up at Wonderful headquarters. Wing okay. bomb. Huh? Do you have time oh. to tell us what happened to you? <laughs> she packs my oh, yes. kid. We must know every detail. Start from when you were oh. and you first knew your destiny was to become a Pinky. <laughs> yep. Well, not much to tell, really. Spitfire told me the Wonderbolts need me to go on tour with them. That's really great. I know how long you've been waiting for a spot to open up. Yeah, yeah that's Fire great. Drake decided to retire and teach full time. Huh? Who? Who? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Who was it again? That's really great. I want to hear that name again. I know again. how long you've been waiting for a spot to open up. Let me hear. Yeah, Firestreak decided to retire and Fire teach Streak. full time. Cloudsdale Flight School will probably be Front. turning out Wonderbolts with him there. Fire Streak. Uh, I don't know who Fire Streak is. First time I've heard of him. Oh, well, looks like a Wonderbolt has retired now, and now Rainbow Dash is now a Wonderbolt. He's taking his place. <laughs> That's great. Anyway, continue. But guess who was at the top of the reserve list? Ooh, ooh, you. Pick me. So what do you do now, Dashie? I have to report to Wonderbolt's headquarters this afternoon. 
It's only two days till oh. tour starts, and I need to learn the routine. You're leaving already? <gasps> but we barely started your congratulation party. I haven't even thought about your graduation oh, party Pinky. yet. Pinky, I'm not leaving Ponyville. I just have to train for this show. I hope everything goes well. It sounds like an awful lot of pressure having to learn everything so quickly. Yeah. Good yeah. luck, Dash. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Well. <laughs> Save that for the rest of the team. Yeah, Maybe well. My awesomeness has finally been recognized. Rainbow can, can handle it. We'll have to keep up or eat my cloud trail. Every pony <laughs> knows you're a great flyer, yeah. Rainbow Dash. But so are the rest of the Wonderbolts. It might be more challenging than you think. Oh, you're right. Yeah. I mean, but I think she can handle it. Sunglasses or not? Sunglasses are automatically cool, but any pony can put them on. Yeah, Maybe true. I'd have more if I didn't. <laughs> Just goes yourself. You don't need. Team briefings are every morning at 0720 because there were 20 ponies in the original EUP guard that became the Wonderbolts. Right. <laughs> and I know you've seen the Academy bunks, but these are the official Wonderbolt barracks, built by Admiral Fairweather himself. What? Don't forget rule number one, newbie. Always check both ways before crossing the runway. Oh. Yeah. That's just like a, uh... Yeah, you know, that's just like the kids' uh, thing of crossing the street. No else is here. They will be. And most of the Wonderbolts like to make a flashy entrance, so stay alert. Right. No problem. Yep. Whoa! Is that General Flash's cap? And the original crest with the Wonderbolts motto on it. Altius Volantis. Soaring higher. Altius Volantis. Oh, wow. Altius Volantis. <laughs> that sounds like Latin. I think later on, maybe I should go on to... Like later on, I should probably go onto the MLP uh, wiki and look up the look up the transcript of this episode and find out what that means in Latin. But yeah, but I'll do that after I react to this episode. But yeah. Anyway, continue. I mean, ha, cool. <laughs> okay, newbie, we've got a show in two days, which means you gotta hustle your haunches to learn this routine. You got five minutes to get dressed and get outside to meet the rest of the team. <laughs> five yes, minutes to get dressed. I'll have all the moves down by the end of the day. Let's hope so. We're all expecting you to make quite an impression. True. First impressions are the most important. Looking huh. good. Okay. You look great you at to Rainbow. Take your first flight as an actual Wonderbolt. <sighs> no pressure. <sighs> Just yep. gotta go up there and knock them off their hooves. Okay, Wonderbolts, get ready to meet your most awesome member ever. Yep. Let's find out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh God. Ow. You in the trash. <laughs> Whoa, most awesome entrance by a newbie ever. Are you okay, Rainbow Dash? More like Rainbow Crash. <laughs> Aw, that's mean. Okay. Yeah, I remember. That's what they used to call. Oh, nasty. More like Rainbow Crash. <laughs> oh. Rainbow Crash. Rainbow Crash. That is just mean. Oh, and the teacher's fucking laughing. What the fuck? Hey, you guys buzz me on purpose. Not quite. You forgot rule number one, newbie. Always check both ways before crossing the runway. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well... Alright, no pony got hurt, and we got a lot to do. So let's forget about this and get flying. Classic rookie move, Rainbow Crash. That was amazing. Aww. Warning, assholes are 
are closer than they appear! Ooh. Assholes. Making fun of... Oh, now they're using that... Now they're insulting her. Oh, so now I guess... Yep. They could have fooled me. Oh. That's just mean. Hey Crash, I know it was a tough day today, but don't worry, you'll get the hang of it. Tough day? Please. Oh. If I can pull off a sonic rain. They're calling her Crash? Nice That's team. mean. I'll have it down cold tomorrow. Probably even come up with a couple of improvements. Although Rainbow she didn't say over here. Yes, ma'am. I'm glad you're still here. Oh yeah? Did you want some ideas on how to make the show extra awesome? Not quite. I know you've been a reservist for a while, but the Bolts have a few of their own rules you might not know about. What's that? Like, worst flyer of the day has to clean up the whole compound. Better get oh. to it, Crash. Aww. Oh. I knew it, I'm surrounded by assholes. Why would you want to go to a place full of a bunch of assholes? Well, I don't blame Rainbow for getting angry, or for getting upset. Surprise! Oh, hey. What? Hooray! Rainbow Dash! Our base is wonderful! Heh. <laughs> wow. I know you're probably tired, Rainbow Dash, but Pinky wanted to throw you a real party. Your best date ever party! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was something alright. Yeah. Well, we can't wait to hear all about it. And I'd love to tell you, I really would, but I'm pretty beat. <laughs> no, nah, he does. She you doesn't know, want to tell them. The excitement of my big day. Um, is something wrong, Rainbow Dash? Yeah. What could be wrong? I'm finally a Wonderbolt, which means everything has to be totally, perfectly awesome. Oh no! They're not buying it. Is wrong. What happened, darling? Yeah. I told you it's nothing. I mean. Yeah, they can tell something's wrong, Rainbow Dash. They can read you like a book. You know, you're you're an awesome flyer, but you're but you're a terrible liar. But you're, I mean, you're not really, and you're not really good at keep, at hiding things. So yeah. Sorry. Some of the continue. Wonderbolts started calling me Rainbow Crash. Oh no! Isn't that the same terrible nickname those bullies in flight school used to call you? Yeah, the assholes. Why would they call you that? Well, I kinda sorta fell into a garbage can. Oh. Mm. Well, yeah, that is disgusting. At least they didn't call you Rainbow Trash! Oh, Pinky! You off on the wrong hoof. Oh. I bet every new Wonderbolt has You're an idiot! Hmm. What you need is to find a positive way to stand out. As soon as you're known for something else, that nasty old How are they gonna? People. How is she gonna do that? Rarity's right. Why don't you think of the Wonderbolts like us? We're a team, but we all stand out in different ways. Really? That's it. I'm gonna stand out in a different way, just like you guys. Really? And how are you gonna do that? Hello, Captain Awesome. I don't think this is a good idea. And how is she gonna do that? Let's just hope she doesn't do anything stupid. Good morning, everybody. Who's ready for a fantastic day of flying? I know I am. I just couldn't be more What? Big show tomorrow. Are you guys Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. That kind of looks like Pinky's hair. Like right at the top there. Oh, she's in it. Oh, no. Is she going to do what I think she's going to do? She's going to imitate her friends. Oh god, well this should be good, or bad, or whatever, but this, well, I think this is going to be a bad impre- he, This is going to rub her work, this is going to make everything worse, but, I'll continue. I'm always excited, some ponies even call me Dynamic Dash, because I'm so full of energy all the time! Uh, what? Wonder both don't get excited, Crash, you gotta keep a level head to fly the way we do. No. Well, of course 
course I know that. But the truth of the matter is, what? you should be excited. What? Apple Jack. <laughs> hang on, hang. <laughs> That's actually clever. It's ironic. Seeing Ashley bought like seeing Rainbow Dash imitate Applejack, considering that they're both voiced by the same by the same voice actress. <laughs> I could imagine Ashley Ball trying to make trying to sound like Rainbow Dash, but try to sound like Applejack at the same time. <laughs> that would have been funny to do. Anyway, sorry, continue. And here you all are doing it. So are you. True. Go ahead and call me forthright Philly if you want, but she yucks. <laughs> I like to tell it like it is. And I believe oh, no. I will appreciate it. Yeah, I can hear a bit of Applejack in that. Being a Wonder Bolt is something special. We know. Yeah. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, you're not... You're not fooling anyone, Rainbow Dash. You know, I was just reading about how dihedral wing angles can help increase stability in banking turns, and made me think that pre-flight checklists could really help increase the <laughs> Oh, this is, so this is not good. Pony. I'm always finding so much interesting information in books. In fact, a lot of ponies call me Reading Rainbow. Ugh. Well, no howling work, newbie! And we already have checklists! Now get out! <laughs> Did you have to do that? Oh, so sorry. Oh, oh no! What a shy! Oh, so much. Yes, I oh God, this is chairman. this is cringeworthy. I can't see. Um, but if you're busy now, I can just come back. Later. I can't watch. Or, you know, I'm sorry, but I just can't watch this. Okay. What? Oh, I can't bear to watch. Oh no, not rarity. I must tell you how much I just love these uniforms. Why, ever since oh. I was a girl, I've admired the many no. old lines and classic contours. They don't call me Rainbow Bash for nothing. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, he's like, what the fuck? Crash! I'm not sure why you're acting like this, but you need to stop. I was just, you know, trying to show every pony all the awesome ways I can contribute to the bolts. I know you're excited to find your place on the team, but just focus on the routine for now, okay? Yes, ma'am. Maybe this will help motivate you. What? Jacket? Crash? Couldn't you just put my regular name on it? That's not how it works around here. We all have our nicknames on our jackets. Right, Clipper? Clipper? Right, Clipper? Now it's official. Welcome to the Wonderbolts, Crash. <laughs> All right. If I don't come up with something unforgettable to add to the routine. I don't think they're trying to be malicious. My life. Yeah. I could sorry to pause, but I could be wrong. But I don't think uh, Spitfire and the other Wonder Bolts are doing it to be spiteful and mean to her. <laughs> sure, it took you long enough to figure it out. If I if only. Like, I think that, like, since they have nicknames, like, Soren's called Clipper, and I don't know what the others are called. I don't even know, like, I don't know why he's called that. But, or either that, or they're just, well, I don't know, but I'll have to watch further to find out whether their intentions are mean or not, but from, from what I see... Like, from what I've seen watching further, I don't think they're doing it to be assholes. Well, not all, not complete assholes. But, yeah, we'll see. We'll see what comes about. Anyway, continue. This is going to be so amazing! I know! I'm almost as excited as Pinkie Pie! I can't wait to see Rainbow Dash <laughs> first for work! Nah. No one can be can rival Pinkie Pie in excitement. We should all remember to be extra supportive for Rainbow Dash too. Excellent point. It's simply yeah. thankful that she's had such a rough start after finally achieving her dream. 
Rainbow Dash is a pretty yeah, resilient true. Buddy. I'm sure she's shaken off her tough first day and turn it around by now. Speaking of... Hey, Dash! Oh, perfect! Hey, can I borrow Scootaloo? Me? What for? Oh, what does she want with Scootaloo? I needed some help and figured the president of the Rainbow Dash fan club was the right pony for the job. I thought the Wonderbolt reserves were here to help. Oh, uh, yeah, they're all busy doing oh, uh, no. official reserve stuff. But don't worry. She's got Scootaloo some kind of bad... Everything's gonna be awesome. She's got some kind of scheme in mind. Does, does that mean practice went well yesterday? Gotta go. That's a no. doing up here, Rainbow Dash? I just need a small favor from you that's really gonna make this show something special. Now, the what? Wonderbolts are gonna fly over this ridge right before the finale of the show. I'll fly by last, and when I signal you, you zip up the ramp on your scooter and kick the storm cloud into my path. What? That kick will shoot off a lightning bolt what? right behind me. Making me look totally awesome. And then I'll do some incredible rainbow dash flying with it to create the coolest, show stopping is lightning tastic light show any pony has ever seen. Are you nope. sure about this? That sounds cool. dangerous. It's gonna be so awesome. And no pony will ever call me Rainbow Crash after this. Oh, gotta go. Be ready for me, okay? It's gonna Please. stuff up. I could see that this plan is going to backfire in Rainbow Dash's face big time. You know? I can just see that happening. Like, it's going to be a stuff up and Rainbow is going to cause a disaster and like, God only knows what kind of disaster and, and just make everything bad for her worse. I do believe you are right. In fact, I think after this, I wouldn't blame... I wouldn't actually blame Spitfire if she fired Rainbow Dash from this. Especially if the... Ra if... Like, especially if it's involving... Like, involving, like, the risk of all the audience and possibly a child, you know, Scootaloo. But... Well, let's see what ha let's see what this what disaster comes. Anyway, continue. Mares and gentle colts, fillies and bulls of all ages, look to the skies and prepare to be awestruck by the incredible flying prowess of the Wonderbolts. Huh. Huh. Wow. Pinkie Pie are done getting their snacks, or they're gonna miss Rainbow Dash. Oh, don't worry, Fluttershy. Yeah. Nothing would keep Pinkie Pie from missing this. <laughs> Except maybe cotton candy. Yeah, touche, Applejack. Come on, Pinkie, the show's starting. One second. Just a little bit bigger, please. But hurry. Bigger. Ugh. <sighs> Ugh. Pinkie Pie. Oh, there's Rainbow Dash. That was amazing. She's doing great. <laughs> Honestly, Pinky, you're gonna get diabetes from what all that candy you eat. Sorry, I had to say that. Yeah. This, works. this is. Yep, yeah, this disaster strikes. Yep, yeah, disaster struck. Yep, yeah, I knew it. Disaster. Ugh. Yeah. She doesn't fly good, does she? Yeah. That's bad. Shocking. <laughs> Shocking. I hope I'm not too late. I don't know what took that pony so long. Ugh. Yeah. 
Ugh. She's crashed. Come on, now's our chance to hop it. Oh, she's hurt. On a scale of one to ten, I'd give that crash an eight. That was amazing. Ugh, piggy pie. Way to go, Rainbow Crash. Yeah, well, that's insulting. <sighs> you gonna tell us what just happened, newbie? I'm so sorry. I should hope so. You changed the <laughs> routine without consulting me and put other ponies at risk. Yeah, knew it. The they didn't know. Us. I know. And I'm ready for whatever punishment you want. You guys were right to call me Rainbow Crash. I've always been a standout flyer, but since I joined the Wonderbolts, I've only stood out for making mistakes. <sighs> it's been my dream my whole life, but I guess mm. maybe I'm not Wonderbolt material after all. Are you serious? You're the most talented flyer we've ever had. And you've saved all of Equestria like a dozen times. I, I, yeah, that's true. Of course supposed to be a Wonderbolt. We've been waiting for a spot to open up ever since you joined the reserves. But you guys all called me Rainbow Crash. Yeah, so? My nickname's Clipper. You know why they call me that? Uh, because you're as fast as a ship? Because no. I clipped my wing on a flagpole as I was landing on my first day. <laughs> what? Huh. Oh, so that's it. Flat flip. My first day, I misjudged my landing and came down right on Spitfire's hoof. Daisy. Slowpoke. Slip and mouth. You don't want to know what they call me. What? Whoa, that is so much worse than Crash, right? <laughs> I'm actually interested. What was Spitfire's nickname? Like judging by how it was, how she whispered it, it probably wouldn't be appropriate. In fact, judging by Spitfire's name and from the way she whispered it and how Rainbow said that's worse than Crash. I could take a guess on what it is. My guess, backfire. And why I think that is because she probably farted while she was on her routine. That's probably a fart joke. And if that is, then I think that's clever material. Well, I'd feel sorry for her for having that name, but yeah, that is probably worse than Rainbow Crash. Yeah, anyway, sorry, continue. So, does this mean I'm still on the team? You think you can be part of this team and not constantly try to showboat? I promise. I spent my whole life yep. trying to be a standout flyer, but now that I'm a Wonderbolt, it's time to be okay with fitting in. Good. Because I really didn't want to miss the chance to tease you for years about this catastrophe. I mean, that crash was <laughs> so epic. <laughs> yeah. But you're on probation for a month. Got a problem with that? No, Fair. so. Probation. Well, that's not so bad. I guess. Hey, Rainbow Dash. We just wanted to check on you. Are you doing okay? I'm doing great, thanks. Sure you don't need any help? Nah, this mess is my responsibility and I've got to clean it up myself. And after this, Spitfire's got me cleaning the Wonderbolt's compound for the next month. Yeah. So why are you I guess that is fair. Duh, because I'm a Wonderbolt! <laughs> well, at least Rainbow's achieved her dream. Congratulations. No shortcuts. You earned it. Well, what do I have to say? I'd say this episode was really, really interesting. It's awesome that Rainbow Dash is now a full-fledged Wonderbolt now. She's achieved her dream. Heh. Yeah. And... You know, I actually thought at first that they were doing, that they were calling a Rainbow Crash to be spite, to be mean to her. But I'd say it's probably sort of yes, sort of no. It's sort of mixed. That's what I think. And I sort of now understand that they call themselves by nicknames because because of mess ups that they had during their first days. Although we didn't get to hear Spitfire's uh, nickname. 
but I could imagine her nickname would probably be Backfire. Like, judging, like, that's just my, my theory. But, yeah. Although, I'm wondering why didn't, why didn't Rainbow Dash talk to them and talk to them in the first place? You know, she could have said, I don't like that name, and asked why they don't like it, and told them about her past. I bet if the Wonderbolts knew, they would have probably, they would have probably sat and talked to her, saying that they, that, that they didn't know, and they wouldn't call her that to be mean to her, it's because they're a teen. So yeah, if Rainbow Dash would have just talked to them and tell them about her past, then maybe they would have understood. And, you know, but instead she had to keep it to herself and, you know, just talk, just keep it, you know, keep quiet and not even mention a thing about it. So yeah, it makes you think if that, if Rainbow would have just talked to them, they would have, you know, whole thing would have been resolved. But then again, if we did, then again, if she didn't do that, it would be a very short story, It'd be a very short episode. Oh, it probably would no, actually it wouldn't have been short, it probably would have been less eventful. But, yeah. But, in a way, you know, I think Rainbow Dash got off light. Well, you know, going on, being on a month of probation. So, I guess that's, I guess that's only fair, considering she did distraught she did cause a disaster but yeah so although I will say that those routines with that those scenes with uh, Rainbow Dash trying to be like trying to like imitating her each of the main six was actually funny like both funny and sort of cringe worthy at the same time and but during some of it, I just couldn't watch it because I knew that because of because you know I was you know yeah it was cringeworthy to watch. Although during the flashback, I should mention something else too. The flashback where Rainbow where Rainbow is a kid and all the kids, including the two assholes, you know the three. Uh, cult bullies that you see in the season one episode, uh, Sonic Rainboom. Like, I did notice something that, I noticed that the teacher was actually laughing. Like, laughing along with the kids bullying. Like, what kind of teacher in their right mind would laugh at a, at a Philly's teasing, bullying, and and unfortunate predicament. Like, just looking at it, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, well... I just hope that teacher got fired for what she did. Like, like fired for what she did. Because, you know, that... That's just wrong. <sighs> Drink. Anyway, it was interesting, but uh, but all in all, I thought it, I thought this episode was okay. It was awesome that now Rainbow Dash is a full-fledged Wonderbolt now, and you know it's awesome that she's now a Wonderbolt because you know she's achieved her dream. But you know, Rainbow Dash is lucky. I wish I was as lucky as Rainbow Dash. You know, because my dream is to become an actor in live action and voiceover. But so far, nothing. So, I just, w I just wish I had half the luck that Rainbow Dash had. You know? Because, you know, it's, it's just a tough thing. You know, just seeing Rainbow Dash achieve something by achieving her dream. I kind of feel... 
I'm proud of her and happy for her, but at the same time, somewhat a little bit jealous. I don't know if that's right. Me being jealous of a cut of a animated character, like an animated fictional character. I don't know whether that's normal or whether that's whatever, but yeah, well, whatever. I'd say it's sort of a well, yeah, well, reasonable or or disturbing. You be the judge. But, yeah, all in all, I thought this episode was entertaining, it was okay, and, yeah, awesome that Rainbow Dash achieved her dream, and, and all of that, so, yeah, I'll leave it at that. I hope you enjoyed my blind commentary of Episode 7 of Season 6, and hopefully I'll get on to Episode 8 as soon as I can, when I get the chance, but as usual, until then... Thank you all for watching. This is Raptamon132 saying bye bye everyone. Bye bye.